Hi, I'm Talon Duncan, owner of Talon Marine Services. Many of us have either seen or heard of the horror stories about ethanol blended fuels. In the shop, we deal with these issues on a weekly basis, so I would like to educate you about ethanol blended fuels. First, ethanol is hydroscopic, which means it draws water in like a damp rid. When water is drawn in, it then separates the ethanol from the gasoline and falls to the bottom of the tank, creating a mixture that no engine can run on. We battle these issues with two things fuel treatments, and water fuel separators. Fuel treatments assist in keeping the ethanol suspended in the gasoline, while water separating fuel filters separate the mixture and hold it in the bottom of the canister. Most water separators have a capacity of about 20 ounces, so they must be inspected, drained, or replaced periodically to ensure they do not overfill and allow contaminated fuel into the engine. Second, ethanol is a detergent, which means it reduces the lubrication capabilities of straight gasoline. Being a detergent, it also has the capability to damage certain types of fuel lines and fuel components that are not rated for ethanol blended fuel. Some of the additives battle this effect, so be wise in the treatment that you choose. So you ask yourself, why my truck or car has not had any issues running on ethanol blended fuel? Well, the fact is the EPA has had strict regulations on the auto industry and made manufacturers vent the fuel system through the engine crankcase. So there is no vent directly to the humid air. In your vehicle, you also cycle through a tank of gas more often than you do in your boat. That brings us back to our golden rule with boats. Don't let them sit. The more often you use it, the less repairs you will have. So if you have any questions, please feel free to call or email us. We're always here to help. Talon Marine Services, where the boating lifestyle is personalized.